NPD woman answers question, do narcissists care for you at all? These are the words of a diagnosed woman with NPD. I like to pretend that I do. Not just pretend in the presence of other people, but in general. My care is selective however. This is because it is all fake. An example, my significant other is currently unwell. He is on medication for depression, and anxiety, and is going through a lot in his own existence. For a long time I pretended that I cared about his physical health, his diet, his mental health, and so forth. Whether or not he had proper clothes for the seasons, whether or not he slept well. I like pretending that I am this good Samaritan who just genuinely cares about those things that is expected of me. I would always over-exaggerate it, and pretend that I was extremely concerned, and worried about his diet, or sleeping pattern, and demand him to eat more fruits, or drink orange juice every morning, just to see if I could control him through fake concern. It was all role-playing on my end, and I enjoyed it to the fullest, because he believed it to be real and I myself enjoyed having him believing that false perception of who I am. But now that he truly is unwell, and is taking medication, and is in need of my care and support, I feel repulsed. I avoid him at any cost, because the care thing was never about him. It was about me. I control when and if I display care, and in what circumstance. I don't like weakness and to me he is weak when he is unwell to this extent. He called me for two hours the other day, and told me about the medications he is on, and how he feels so depressed, and low and blah blah blah. It disgusts me. After that call I have not reached out to him, nor have I replied to any of his attempts at reaching out to me. For me, displaying care is about me wanting to be perceived as a good person. But I do not want to be forced into that role because someone needs me to be a good person. I can pretend to be a good, and caring person when I want to be perceived that way, but it is an act. Theatre. And now while he is so unwell, and in need of my care and support, I feel annoyed with him. Repulsed. As a narcissistic person, I do not want to be around people who annoy me. I am there to feel good about myself, not disgusted with someone's weakness, and pathetic state of mind. I know it is shallow, but that is just how it is for me. I will continue to avoid him at any cost until he gets his life, and mental state together. Until then, bye Felicia. I have already plotted what I will say when he eventually asks me why I have been avoiding him and ignored him for so long. I will say, oh no, I just assumed you required some time, and space to deal with your own stuff. I did not ignore you, I respected you, and the process you are in. Thank you for listening to Narcissist Essays, and please subscribe to my channel. Sending lots of love and strength to those of us, victimized by narcissists.